Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. Well, good morning. After a soggy night last night, the bulk of that steadier rainfall has worked its way out this morning, but we still have a couple of leftover showers to get through before we're expecting that nice midday lull right through the afternoon. How about a step outside here in Dallas on the campus of Misericordia University? Still a light little mist, if not some drizzle coming down, but the bulk of that rain has really tapered off. Let's go to radar back in central Pennsylvania. White Deer, Lewisburg near Forest Hill, Mifflinburg just to the south of Williamsport, Riverside and Picture Rocks, and all the way back near Lock Haven, a very Light shower making its way through. Nothing compared to what we saw overnight last night with those steady rounds of rain and some good heavier downpours on top of that. But that has now moved off to the east and it's some more disorganized showers for the rest of this morning. As we take satellite and radar out for a better view, there's that midday break back in the Ohio Valley. But that cloud cover really will not be going anywhere. Our second round of rain is going to make its way in later today. Right now it's all the way back in the Midwest, but we'll be settling in through this evening and going through the night tonight. Temperatures there in the 40s and 30s. Williamsport 43, Mount Pocono at 34, Wilkesbury and Scranton 41 and Pottsville. We're at 38, so temperatures not all that bad this morning. We will make it back into the lower and even the mid 50s again for that high, which keeps us above the average coming in right around 47. This is still not the warmest air we'll see this week. Remember, temperatures will push near 70 for tomorrow. More of that in just a second, but here's that lingering cloud cover. Notice that the rain does taper off going into the afternoon, but there's that second round moving in late this evening and going into tonight with a few more scattered showers Then out ahead of this cold front tomorrow. A few showers and I wouldn't even rule out a thunderstorm later in the day as this front pushes through just out ahead of it. That's when temperatures are in the 70s. But behind that front, the good news is for the weekend, we will get some good sunshine back, but the cooler air starts to take back over, so it will be much more seasonal come Saturday and going into Sunday. But like I said, having that sunshine back and it being a dry weekend will be rather nice. 54 for the high today. Here's that hour by hour starting with some showers this morning. Then for the rest of the day, it's really a decent break, but that cloud cover is going to continue to hang around. Tonight we'll have some more showers, 46 for the overnight low. And other than that, the cloud cover just hangs around through tonight. Tomorrow there's some more scattered showers. Temperatures push into the 70s and even a good thunderstorm we'll keep an eye out for. Clouds and sunshine on Saturday as the cooler air comes back in. The wind will start to pick up. 44 on Saturday. Sunday we're also in the mid 40s with a decent amount of sun. Monday looking for some rain and snow showers at 42. That's something you'll want to keep checking back for updates on. Tuesday a mix of clouds and sun. We're in the mid 50s. Wednesday looking for a few more showers and temperatures are in the lower 50s. And we can always download the Eyewitness Weather app to get your latest updates on the weather. The forecast is always available for you at pahomepage.com. And let's not forget, guys, it's the first day of spring. And you looked it up. You said it starts at 11.50 That's when the PM. vernal equinox is. It's at 11.50 p.m. So we get about 10 minutes today, and then tomorrow is the first full day, and we're in the 70s. You know, still good enough for me. 10 minutes. I mean, that's that's still all spring <laughs> yeah. today in, yes. in, in my mind. So if we so. want to get technical, yeah, 10 minutes, but mm -hmm. it's still the first day of spring, no matter what way we put it. Exactly. Regardless, you can still say spring starts today. Yes. And we'll go mm -hmm. with that. Well, coming up, taking advantage.